It's almost 720. Let's get over to David and check out our forecast. All right, well, as we look at the tropics right now, fortunately, not much going on locally here across the Gulf of Mexico, the East Coast of the United States. That's some good news. We are watching one feature though way out here in the Atlantic, but you can see locally uh, just a little upper level low spinning here in the central part of the Gulf. Nothing significant with that, which is great. Caribbean looking pretty good too. little thunderstorms there near Central America, but nothing to worry about tropically. And we do have this uh, wave, a uh, 60% chance of development with this one here over the next five days. Looks like it has the potential to maybe become a tropical depression. Then another the way behind this one looking pretty impressive. Wouldn't be surprised if the Hurricane Center highlights that a little later on during the day today. Now beyond that, you can see that we have the one we're watching there. Then there's the second wave here and then the third one still over Africa. So we're starting to see quite a bit of waves working the way through uh, the intertropical convergence zone. As for Invest 95, chance of development is mentioned at 60%. Winds are at 30, moving west at 17. Pressure still fairly high at 1,009 millibars. Forecast models do kind of agree with our westward track with this and then they kind of split up here. It's likely it's going to be running into some dry air and some dust and that is likely also going to be impacting wind shear with this as well too and likely will dissipate the system as we get toward the end of the week. So if it does become a tropical depression, looks like this one will be continuing to kind of fall apart out here. So we'll continue to watch this one and the one behind it, but at this point, nothing we need to worry about here across the Gulf Coast.